there is nothing like Glanbourne. Every time you come here, you're in for a shock. For people who love opera, or for people who want to get to love opera, it offers a unique experience. Theatre and music combined in the most dazzling display. Broadway can't compete with it, actually. It can't. There is going to the opera, but that's quite different from coming to Glyndebourne. We are blessed with fabulous surroundings, the South Downs, fields filled with sheep and cows grazing. I'm sure an awful lot of people in England probably think heaven might be a little bit like this, a little bit of Mozart coming across the lawn. Certainly I might. I think the time scale of Glyndebourne separates it from other places. I, I think it's somewhere where you don't just rush in and see an opera and go home. Yes, you do possibly have to take the afternoon off work, maybe the whole day, but actually that's part of the appeal. I love the escape of coming to Glanbourne, the fact that it is a journey, that you leave the city and within an hour you're surrounded by the most beautiful countryside. You don't have to wear a black tie, but I think um, people do like to dress up and I think that it, it adds to the occasion. Bring your picnic and just, I don't know, Escape it all. Beautiful music, beautiful surroundings. Does it get much better than that? But it's not just a sort of eccentric aristocrats play thing. I mean, this has become a festival which is second to none. You just feel like being in a, some kind of a specially constructed paradise for artists. It just makes you concentrate on the main issue, which is art. It's about producing the best that we possibly can and something that we are truly proud of in terms of quality, innovation and excitement. I see it as a place for really exciting music and it's as simple as that. It has some of the greatest singers in the world, a truly remarkable chorus, the highest possible production values and the world's greatest orchestras. There's a huge attention to detail from the costumes to the wigs to the staging and the musical preparation. The festival is back uh, and we're all looking forward to an amazing summer of, of opera. Glyndebourne has a place in my heart that will, you know, will be there forever. There is a special energy about this place. You know, I'd exhort you to come here. The only thing we ask of people is that they enjoy themselves.